I'm gonna start charging you for my intro. <laughs> yeah, each intro you get a nickel. Hey, Zanzorians, welcome back. We are continuing. We were here forever. I'm here with Nightlight. He's gonna help me out with this. Say hello. Hello again. <laughs> so we're having some difficulties. Um, we're able to resolve some issues with the server not being selected properly. So I will say this: if you're having issues where it's showing Europe. Uh, if you turn off the auto select option and choose the area that you're in, you shouldn't have issues. You have to leave the game and come back to get fixed. Now, it's been a long time since we played. So there's, we're, we think we're at chapter three of the graveyard, but I guess we're going to find out. You can go ahead and start it. Oh. <laughs> you guy just freaked out. <laughs> Where are we? I like the lanterns. I'm scared. Over. Balls. <laughs> Not over. Whoa! Dude! My dude like flew up in the air. Like really high. Okay, hold on. It's kind of like jumpy for me. Give me a second. Alright, I think I'm better. I hope. Let me in. Can you open this? No. A giant owl. Maybe ring the bell. Oh. Oh. Hello? It has an X here. It doesn't, oh, do we just need a key? Maybe the key's down here. Maybe it's in this coffin. Dancing on his grave. <laughs> well, I will say it stopped It stopped bugging out on me, so I think we're okay. Oh, it's a puzzle. So, okay, we are in the graveyard. All right, we got to open this. I'm scared. Oh, it's a ghost! Oh, I just fell in the hole. <laughs> you fell in a hole? Yeah, I fell into the well. The and there's a guy down here. A dead guy. It says, It lies hidden within the vault. I'm sure of it, but I could not find the keys. Okay. Okay, well, this other gate opened up, so I guess I'm gonna. I have a pickaxe. Go mining. I am. Get some gold. Yeah. One There's swipe. Gold in them hills. Okay, I got a torch. Looking around. That's blocked off. There's spiders. Oh, those are creepy spiders. They got glowing eyes. Spiders everywhere, man. I like this. Yeah, here's spider. You got some uh, symbols on your end? I do. I just ran into that. Okay. Um, you got some gears and a bucket that's pouring out something. And you got a hammer and a right angle thing. A hammer and a right angle. So the only thing, what I have, my symbols are a sword, a shield, a crown, actually a queen's crown, um, a king's crown. I don't know what this is. It looks like, like a kettlebell, uh, a chain, and a clock. Okay, I see that. Oh, and it says, okay, there's also a piece of broken tablet off to my left. I have like the left side of the tablet and it has okay. like from bottom to top it has shield, sword, clock, queen's crown. The queen's crown has like less spooky things coming up. I thought it had more. Alright, well I got a flask at the bottom, a book, a chain, and then the more crown. Okay, let me pick these up then because there might be something on the other side. Oh, okay. All right, guys, so the game crashed, but we think we kind of understand this puzzle now. So we're going to move forward with trying to swap some thingies. All right, so we need to get you that. I'll keep that here. I need to get you the... Here, I'll give you the king's crown <coughs> for the queen's crown. Mine. And, and the queen's crown for the chain. You mean King's Count for the chain? Yeah, that one. 
Alright, and then I was gonna give you the flask for your... What was it? Flask for your book. book. Boom. Okay. okay. And then book for the chain. Okay. So I guess I'll at least do this. Okay, go ahead and give me the sword. And then go ahead and put the shield in there and I'm gonna give this sword back. No, that's not. Oh yeah, that is, okay. Okay. So just throw that there for now. So now I have queen, king, and chain. You have clock, sword, okay. So if that's the case, give me the clock. Uh, I just gave you the queen's crown. And then can you use can you use the sword on your side? Uh, the sword can be placed with either the clock or the shield. I can't remember what your top four were. I no. think it was... No, okay. So I need to get that back. So go ahead and put the sword in, and I'll give you the clock back. Okay. So that at least gets this one over here. And I'll put this... Right up my butt. Right there. Okay. <laughs> um... So the, I have a king's crown and a chain. The king's crown can get the queen's crown from you. Uh, so I'm gonna give you, yeah, go ahead and give me the queen's crown back. I hope I'm doing this right. And then the king's crown can be traded with the chain, right? Yep. Okay, I'm gonna give you the chain. Okay, cool. And then, so you can probably place the chain on the wall with your stuff. Uh, what do you have left? I don't know if you can place anything. Uh, so if I place everything that I can place, I just have a clock. Okay, cool. That's perfect. I'm going to give you the queen for the clock. And this should do it. Yay! We're amazing. Don't, don't, don't you crash on me. Okay, there's like s several ways for me to go, so bear with me. I hey, I see you. Really big staircase. You hear that chain stuff? Yeah. I'm scared. Oh, it's right here. There's gears. Oh, we're missing a gear. Are you missing a gear as well? Yeah. Look look to your top left. Is it spider? I know. <laughs> spider. Oh, I, I, I have I'm a pixel. I'm gonna burn ya. I'm gonna burn ya. I'm burning ya. You're dead. Okay, I can go down here, and then I can go up above. So, like that. Okay, give me a minute. I'm gonna go up here, because I think there's like multiple things. Okay, I don't see anything I can pickaxe. Let, let's meet up in the center. I'm going to see if I can hand you my pickaxe. Come on, this hole should be big enough for that. Already, no. Okay, well, I think you need... I think what we need to do, we need to get this gate open because then I can knock down those walls for you. Can you... Is there anything else over there? Nope. Okay, give me a minute. Um, there's, uh, there's a few things over here for me. So let me just read this, so... There's a casket that says, a maker of the clock, she admired the peacock. Okay. Oh, what? Uh, what the hell is this? It looks like it's different classifications. There's a glass blasier, so a glass blower, a clock maker, a stonemason, and I don't know what this is. A brongeiter. I don't know if that's like alchemist or something. What the hell was that? Did you just do something? Yeah. Okay, you just took something from me. That was weird. 
I took a pile of snow. Okay. This is great. Wait, are you able to bring that back down? Uh, did you pull a lever? How'd you do that? They were just like, uh, yeah, essentially a lever. Let me look. It's like a crank thing to to do wells. All right, let me give you the pickaxe. See if you could... Yeah. I can place it in there. Go ahead, you can grab that it now. That is so stupid. There has to be a way to send it back because I don't have a lever here. Um, so I'm curious to see if you knock down the wall and then you can send it back after that. Which, if that was the case, that was a, a huge oversight. <laughs> I'm breaking down the wall. Okay, I have a bunch of graves here. Okay, you have graves too. I got some, some goose graves, a peacock grave. Okay. Okay, so this, that's going to align with these, I have puzzle phrases, so the peacock aligns with this one. A maker of the clock, she admired the peacock. So, the clock maker is going to be wherever that peacock grave is. I've got like a bunch of different birds too. I've got like a, I don't know, like an eagle or hawk. Okay, here, let me, <laughs> ah, excuse me. Bless let me run around and just read off these things really quick so we there's a this is printed on the wall so this is what we're looking for i think each one of the graves that you open they probably can have keys in them and it says five keys buried with denizens of our town left for those that defy the wicked crown so you're probably gonna have keys on your side that you'll send to me i have a vault that has four hands linked to each other that all have keyholes in them so i need to open this up so i need from what it seems like, I need four keys. And then you might need one key. Uh, and then, here, I'll read the stuff inside the caskets. So give me just a second. So we already know about the clockmaker and the peacock. Uh, we have the final descendant of the glass blazier line. Whatever that means. Uh, the Steinhauer, who sleeps beside her brother. Um, hold on, I got some more over here. Oh, I got a key. Got nothing over there. I got a key with gears on it. I got two more here. Uh, chose the bird he loves as his son's name. And then his XXX marked grave lies in his father's row. Is that everything? I, uh, I sent you a key. I heard. Also, it turns out that there was a lever to pull. It was just hidden a bit. Oh. What was that? Did you hear that? Yeah. What did it say? Okay. So, I think I hit the wrong grave, and I think if we hit it, hit the wrong one too often, then we lose. Oh, okay. <laughs> that sucks. All right, well, I will take this key and I'm gonna see if I can use it on here. Okay, yes, so that key, that gear key is what I need. I was able to use it on the hand and now I just have three hands to unlock. All right, so, oh, the peacock, that grave is all, they, they wiped it out. So that puzzle has been solved apparently. Okay. So that's, that's good, so as we solve puzzles, the clues for that puzzle will uh, disappear. I like it. All right, so I guess the next thing I can tell you, I uh, there's one other thing I have here that gives me like more information. Um, I have portraits here that show the family tree. Uh, and then each portrait, they're separated, so I have to run around to find them. But um, they basically say what type of uh, trade they were doing so the glass uh, gla glace blasier and then underneath that it has names of people that's what i need just to just want to make sure i'm looking at this right male and female the symbols for that male is the one with the arrow right uh it has to be yes oh. yeah these seem like yeah bruno is the male's name okay cool i'll make sure okay okay the Steen Howier who sleeps beside her brother. 
Uh, so it might be easier if you gave me names of individuals. Uh, there's a lot. How many? So, uh, like a lot. I got. So here, I can. Here, I, I can tell you this. I, here, I'll do this. The Steen Howier sleeps beside her brother. I don't know how to say this, so it's spelled Y D E, <laughs> like D, but with a Y. Yd, im so it, I M S O E T E. What was the uh, the thing Ankel? Uh yes, but don't don't just open it because there's these are using multiple name like the same name all over the map, but it's A N G H E L. It's this one. I know it. <laughs> um. So you have an Engel? Right. I'm sending you the key. Oh, did you get it? Yeah. Oh, okay, cool. So what was that one? Yeah. Well, way to go. So now we got the right angle one. We got the gear one. Yep, just open that. Let me just verify. I should have wiped away that clue. Whoops, the clue is up here. Yeah, that clue yeah, is gone. Excellent. All right, so there's the... Glass Blasier line. Uh, the final descent in that one. Then I have, I have a couple of other ones. So, all right. So here's one. Chose the bird he loves as his son's name. This uh, is probably Robin? the. Hold on. I this... can't tell. Robin is more like a girl name. So, the names that have bird names are the Bronx, Gheiter. <laughs> <laughs> um, so what did I say? It's, uh, chose the bird he loves as his son's name. I don't, I, I don't know if these are all birds. There's Robin. I know Falco would be a bird, like a falcon. Y S E B R A N T. Y S. That's correct. B Y S E. Uh, yeah. B so yeah, I do. that might be right because. Here, let me just double check. It says, chose the bird he loves as his son's name. Yeah, that's probably it. Choose that one. All right, that was it. Yeah. Yeah, because there was only Robin and Falco, and those are the two birds. And Robin obviously was a female. No, no. Robin was a male name. But whatever. So there's, uh, his XXX marked grave lies in his father's row. Like, for the XXX line, there's... It's like XXX, uh, Ryan, we, Henrik, and Lideldi. Lideldi, Henrik, Ryan, we. Yeah, and then XXX. Oh, they have one labeled XXX there? Yeah. Oh, that's Ulrich. The XXX is Ulrich, then. That's weird. That I'm seeing it in a different location. All right, I'm just going to hit XXX. Let's do it. Yep. Bam. What happened? That was a key. Okay. So the, Which one was it? Uh, It's a fist key. A fist? Or do you key? mean like which? Oh, I meant like mean which grave I hit. Yeah, yeah. Was it the hit, one with Falco and I stuff? I hit the one with like uh, Didwin and Falco. It was it was fifty fifty. Okay, well. I've only seen the other one. Well, yeah. Go ahead and send that my way, and then I'll see if I can open up this door at least. And I'm I'm also curious to see if both of those puzzles disappear or if there's one more we have to solve. Okay, looks like my door is opening, so give me a minute. Let me see if there's anything else we have to do. Oh, there's one more key. Yeah, so there is one more key. It just opened up a uh, an item, and there's one more key I need. So that was the XXX one. So we're done with the XXX. Okay, so the last one is the final descendant of the Glass Blasier line. So let's go to that area. And it said the final descendant. Seven. All right, Henrik. Fifty-six. Rhinewe. Uh, 
That's 61. Okay, so so far Ryanwee is the winner. And then Ulrich. Uh, I don't see that one in this lot. Bleh. Was that right? Ryanwee, Ryanwee had the, was the oldest. Although it's weird because like, you know, Final Descendant, you would think that the guy still alive would be the final, but... Right, but... I guess the final dead descendant. Yeah, I guess it, that's up for the interpretation. But we did it. Wow. Yeah, because I agree with you. I always assume the final descendant is going to be whoever's still alive, regardless of when the, whether they're when they were born. Uh, my, my gate is still locked down here. Okay, I think I can open it for you. Hold on, I just got into a new area. Oh. Okay, I think I know what I'm looking at here. So I found a graveyard map and i think this is what you see i see an overview of it when you got into the graveyard you went in through where the the owl gate was open right that's how you got in owl to begin gate. with yeah at the very beginning when i fell down the well did you go through uh, yeah. yeah okay good that's exactly what i'm seeing so i see the owl up here so i kind of know where you went all right so you're gonna head into the grave and then when you go you're gonna hug the left so when you're hugging the left there's don't go in there but there's an entryway to one of like the plots that has all the family graves correct yep um so you're gonna skip that one and keep on going but the next one you come up to you're gonna want to go into that one but don't go all the way in just right. get ready to go in so all right i'm in right when you go in there you want to immediately make a right and there's going to be a couple I of ca dig yes so there's a couple of caskets um in between two caskets the x lies so and they're going to be along the right wall when you made that immediate right they yep. should be right along the right wall so in between those two caskets there's an x and you can dig there i got a i got a little little piece of paper it's 14 there's 14 and there's one equals parentheses three equals three parentheses five equals five oh and my kid is a circle and 40 is four circles okay hold on i just i didn't realize my another gate opened for me after we after you dug that up in the corridor i just have like symbols Okay, so you said that you got a piece of paper. Oh god! Wait, what just happened? I didn't know I could do that. What? Okay, um, apparently... I can open these up, I don't know why, and... I got a map... of places where you can... I just got a map of a place where you can dig. And then you're gonna go into that family's grave plot uh you're gonna go okay. all the way up to the top to the left um right up against the wall i see it and oh i have a gear above each one of these like tombs that i'm breaking open that i can break open um above each one of them there's like a, a number of circles and then a number of parentheses Yep, I got I got little charts for them. Oh, really? Yeah. Oh, okay. Well, that helps. So um, each of the parentheses is like one, and then all the circles are ten. Oh. Um, so one of them I have is fourteen, and the other one's twenty-three. Fourteen and twenty-three. So each one of the circles is ten, and parentheses is one. Yep. So fourteen and twenty-three. That's very helpful. Oh, I found 23. It's right here. I'm gonna go ahead and open this one. I found a gear. Yippee! I don't know what 14 was. Yippee. Oh wait, 14 was the first one I did. Oh, okay. All right, come with me. So I just got lucky when I chose that one. Or you cheated. I didn't cheat at all. All right, you gotta help you me push this thing. Bastard. It's heavy. Hey, dude. No. We push them. Oh, 
Ooh, magnifying glass. I see you. I take it. Then we go this way. I'm slow with this thing. Slow poke. Ah, uh, we did it! Alright, I'm supposed to... Where am I supposed to put this thing? Up here? Oh, is this supposed to go... Don't we have to go up over there? Into the tower? It would be wonderful. Rent is cheap. <laughs> where do you find people to do the work for you when you have maintenance? Um, you you enroll the local penguins. Uh -oh. What just happened? Uh oh, he's gonna yell at us some more. <laughs> Why have you failed in bringing me those desecrators? These rats, <laughs> they cower in nooks. Cracks, crannies, and corners. Fear not, my majesty. Fear. <laughs> <laughs> See to it that you succeed, or I will teach you the true meaning of fear. Oh, what are you going to do, old man? Stuck in your filthy keep. Stuck. 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 <laughs> what the heck? I didn't see the jester off to the left for a minute. I was staring I at the know castle. What the going on. I'm scared. Let's go ahead and pull this again. Believe I'm me, on I'm my so way. fast and free spirited. <laughs> I'm slow and stupid. <laughs> Whoa. I'm feeling some drag. This is weird. I think he's trying to load everything right now. Right, I think I put this right here. Boom! The Seer! We got one more. Hey, that's it. Well, we'll stop right here because we're all done. So, we, yeah, we have... Wait, hold on. Do you want to go back and go to that new area? Let's at least go into the new uh, area before we exit. I feel like I just, like, poked it and it just started working. This is all me. I'm doing it with my mind. Oh, we have to get on. What the heck's that? The dead guy. Alright, I'm gonna take this seat. Oh, Wimmer threw me. Oh, my ghost! I'm dead oh. already! There's a dead body. Hey, buddy, you doing okay? Throw him on you. <laughs> oh, he's frozen! <laughs> <laughs> Dropped him right on your face. <laughs> We're so disrespectful. How rude. The ruins of Rockberry. Hmm. Smells like trouble. Boom, go, boom. Who's keeping the lights on? Um, fireflies, the magic. Fairies, I don't know. Alright, guys, we are going to stop right here. We are at the last portion of at least this zone uh, the Rockberry. This is going to be a little bit, though, so. But hopefully you guys are enjoying this. We will be continuing very soon. So see you in the next episode. Who's all? Who's all?